What's up guys, Hammer7 Junior Gaming over here and today we're going to be doing a short tutorial on how to move your Steam files or Steam game files from one hard drive to the next. So, we're going to start it with Stranded Deep and we're going to see that the properties local game files are in the I drive at 681 megabytes. So, now that we know where the drive is, what I want us to do is we want to go to the folders, this PC, and we said it was in the I drive. You'll see it's in the Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and we are going to copy Strata Deep. So, you want to right click in the game files and say cut. From there, you want to change it. Let's say I want to change it to the F drive. So, from the F drive, no wait, let's not say F drive. Let's say let's do it in the, just because I'm winging this, we're going to go to the G drive. So, from the G drive, what you want to do is you want to create a new folder that says Steam. And then in Steam, you want to create another new folder that says Steam Apps, just like that. And from Steam Apps, you want to make another folder that says Common. So just like the directories everywhere else. So in the Common folder, you want to right click and say Paste. So Stranded Deep should copy, it should be quite quick because it's a fairly small game. So guys, that's done. Very soon, now it's done, cool. So now it's been copied over, it's no longer in the iDrive. So guys, you want to go back to Steam, and then you want to just double check that it hasn't done anything. It's still saying that it's in the iDrive, and we have it actually changed it to the G Drive. So there, as you, there as you can see it. Now we're back at Steam. Sorry guys, so then you want to go right click on the Stranded Deep, and you'll say Delete Local Content. So once you, it'll delete the files, which is no longer there, so it won't delete anything. And as you can see, it's grey, not like the rest of these ones. And once you click on it, click on the Stranded Deep again, uh, click Install, and you're going to see that there's a drop-down menu. So click on the drop-down menu, and you need to now find the new file. So you say, create a new Steam library on Jar Drive G. So you click on that, and you'll see there's the file that we created, Steam, and you just click on the Steam. That's what you just need to do, so you just select install under G Steam, you say next and preparing stranded files, discovering existing files for stranded deep as you because we copied the stuff over and it's allocating boom Steam has finished downloading stranded deep it should work because I'm pretty sure that it's not where it says it is now but anyway stranded deep you say properties local game files then it says G drive okay guys so it is as simple as that if you want to save space move your games around then this is what you need to do you like the video you know what to do it turns blue leave any comments if you have any questions thanks for watching until next time guys cheerio